guys welcome back to my channel sand and nas techie and uh, this is the 10th video tutorial under python scripting for storage admin and in this video we will see how we can send email through python script so so far we have uh, wrote a script which will collect some information and save the output in a local folder so if you want then you can definitely go to that particular folder and read the content but you can automate that also by writing a script which will read the content of that particular file and send it over in a mail so that's we are going to see today so before proceeding further don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that whatever new video i upload in my entire channel or in this particular series you will get notification immediately So this is the script that I have already written in order to save some time. So you can see many lines are hashed out. That means that when we execute the script, these lines will not be executed. So I have done this in order to save some uh, time. So if you want to know what these lines will do, you may go through the previous videos of this uh, playlist and uh, you will be able to know what exactly these uh, particular lines will do. So before proceeding further, let me tell you this particular script will send a email from my public email address that is gmail.com to a yahoo.co.in so many of the lines are there that is not necessary if you are writing the script in your environment so i will let you know which are those lines you can skip if you are running this in a production environment first of all we have to import some uh, module the first one is smtp lib which is the library or the module which deals with the email sending part so these two lines will end encapsulate all the content like the subject line from address to address and uh, it will send the proper email in correct format now if we will scroll down these are the lines which will exactly send the email so you can see that the subject line i have mentioned here test mail the from address we have to mention i have uh, used gmail.com so in your case you can uh, use any email address in your environment so two section deals with uh, whom you are going to send the email cc if you want to keep someone in cc then this is the field here then the text uh, info collector this one is not mandatory if you want you can uh, omit this particular line the next four line will make sure that whatever data is present in this particular variable will be sent over in the mail now we have to connect uh, to the smtp server of the gmail.com so this is the line which will uh, do it so here we have to mention the smtp.gmail.com in your case you have to mention the smtp servers of uh, your environment that you are using for smtp services and the port number is 587 for uh, gmail smtp in your case you may not have to mention this one these two lines you can uh, skip if uh, you are using your own smtp server in your environment and now as i am using the gmail public email service so here i have to mention a credential so i have uh, stored my credential in this particular uh, file and i am reading those uh, credentials by using this line this particular line will log into the gmail server and then this particular line will send the mail to the required address that is yahoo.co.in and uh, now we will quit the connectivity to the smtp server of the gmail.com so this is my yahoo mail address you can see there is nothing here so i will run this script now and we will see if the script is working properly or not so the script has started running usually it will take some time because it's a public email address so it will take some time to connect to the smtp server of uh, the gmail and then it will send the mail to the required address so now uh, let's wait for some time and see if the mails are coming in the script i can see that the first line and the second line has been executed so we can see the mails here anytime now so here we can see that we received two mail because we have uh, collected the informations for uh, two servers and uh, for each server it has sent two mails if you want you can combine all those content in a single file and send a single mail as well this was the first uh, email and this is the second email with subject line test mail so this is how you can uh, write a script which will send information through mail 
by using python script so this is a simple script that i have uh, written here you can manipulate this script as well to send mail or uh, collect informations in a efficient manner so that's all for this uh, video if you have any questions or any suggestion you can put it in comment section and again don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon so that uh, whatever video i upload you will get the notification immediately thank you for watching this video